exception of Ron, uh, I'm the only private sector executive that actually works in Manhattan here, in an industry unrelated to the city of Hoboken, the county of Hudson, or the state of New Jersey. And I think that's important. We need somebody that has a separation between business and municipal politics. Uh, I've been here for 14 years. I got here the day after college. I spent seven of those 14 years serving the city as both the zoning board commissioner, and then two years back, I defeated a 21-year incumbent, somebody that everybody said was unbeatable. And they said not to run. And I ran based on ideas and a vision of belief that this community could come together, old and new, black and white, Hispanic and Italian. And I showed them in this election that an outsider and an independent could win. And that conversation has continued to this day. Nobody expected to see me on the city council, and I've always worked through the political divide in the best interest of my neighborhood. I know that my private sector background, handling tens of million dollars worth of budgets, uh, partnerships, management, uh, project, uh, you know, projects of all shapes and sizes will benefit this city. So it's the combination between my public experience as well as my private experience. And fr quite frankly, I'm very proud to say that I'm the first gay elected official in the city of Hoboken. My partner is somebody that helps underserve. Quiet, please. No applause necessary for being true to who you are, so I appreciate it, though. And my partner has served this community and underserved communities as a physician, as a Guatemalan immigrant. So together, I believe we can have a progressive city hall that is open to everyone. Thank you very much, Bob.